Yeah, it was, um, you know, I thought the first period, uh, I thought we were a little lethargic in the first period uh, of the game. And then, um, you know, we were able to, uh, you know, get that goal. Ryan made a terrific play, I thought. You know, he used his speed, took it wide, and wrap around on Huddy's right there in the back door. Uh, and then the second period, uh, you know, when Chase's line got us going, I thought they were very good all night long. Uh, Bradley, Capone, and Frazier, I thought they were heavy and hard all night long. Uh, but then, you know, I thought we got a little sloppy, but the challenge for the third period was to go out and play a really strong, hard-nosed, uh, detailed third period and find a way to win a hockey game. And I think, you know, I thought we did a really good job with that up until, especially for the first, I thought, 15 minutes of that period, we did a good job managing the puck. So, oh, uh, <coughs> excuse me, overall, um, that was a good win, but we're gonna have to be better tomorrow to get the sweep. Mike, does Chase get enough credit for being as physical as he is? He does for me. Uh, I think well, he's, matters. yeah, I, I think he's, such a good, complete hockey player. And, you know, Nick's playing right along with him, very similar game right now. So it's nice to have that line be able to set the tone physically for us. That tip that Nick had, is that kind of come natural to him? Is that something he's, I mean, he looked like Kreider in front of him. It was a great play and, and we need to have more of that from Nick. I mean, that's where he's got to live. He's a, he's a power forward who's, you know, extremely physical, but he's got, really good hands uh, and, and he's got an offensive uh, toolbox and I'd like to see that flourish this year. Line of Baloo, he slipped and Percival, their first shift in the first period seemed to kind of change the momentum and everybody seemed to get a lift. Did you see that? On the yeah, board? they did a nice job and then they scored a big goal after they, you know, was, I don't know how long after that they scored, uh, you know, almost a minute and a half later after they made it two to one, uh, Jake, fantastic shot bar down there to make it 3-1, which was a good momentum shift for us. Two Connecticut kids in the second period. We've heard you for many years talk about uh, the importance of recruiting here in state. Kind of a cool moment in the second period, open night in the Hartford, two Connecticut kids. Yeah, scored. it's great. You know, I think we had at least three in the lineup, I think, tonight, right? So, um, and Lewis is the oh, I'm sorry, yeah. four, right? Four guys. So, uh, yeah, they're good Connecticut hockey players. Those are the ones we want to keep bringing here. <laughs> how, do you, how would you assess uh, Logan's performance in goal? I thought he was pretty solid. I think he made saves when he had to. Um, you know, they're a very, very good team off the rush. Uh, I think that's a real strength to their team. So when you turn the puck over, they get dangerous. And they had some couple good looks and Logan made some timely saves for us, that's for sure. He did a really good job against the top one against the or Robertson and Diegas. You, they got five shots off, but it didn't seem like anything was dangerous. You, you kids did a really good job against them. Yeah, and they're a talented group. And, and again, that's when they're out there, you really have to manage the puck because they'll hurt you in transition. What do you like? How do you think your US ID's doing? I think he's doing a fantastic job. Better than the old one? <laughs> Not ready to go there yet, you know? Bill's a wily veteran, so we'll, we'll leave that alone. Will we see Logan and Goal again tomorrow? We haven't made that decision yet. We'll watch the tape and, uh, you know, I'll talk to Vince and we'll make a decision tomorrow morning. When their goalie, uh, Murphy, was started 61 games, uh, went down, what's the thought on the bench there? To, with, with yeah, him? I didn't know. Um, I didn't know what was going on at first. I thought he was just stretching out and the ref was giving him time to stretch out. I didn't realize that they put another goalie in there until one of the kids said they just switched goalies. So apparently he either cramped up or he had some type of injury. Because I think he skated off the ice, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. we didn't know what was going on either. So yeah. as smart as the TV people, it's not the best.